21st Century Literacy In this short video, I will explain what literacy looks like in the 21st century and how it impacts our young learners. I will also share the current approaches we will be taking to support your child on their journey of becoming literate citizens of the digital age. What does it mean to be literate in the 21st century? Traditionally, students were required to interpret and comprehend predominantly text-based text with an emphasis on written language. Conventional literacy is concerned with the basic ability to read and write the written word. In an increasingly globalised world, it is no longer sufficient to just teach students how to read and write. To help them understand and read their world, an approach to teaching literacy should acknowledge the dynamic way in which messages and information are delivered to them. Definition of literacy has expanded and requires 21st century students to develop a flexible, sustainable mastery of a set of capabilities in the use and production of traditional texts and new communication technologies. Literacy can also be described as the ability to identify, understand, interpret, create, communicate and compute varying materials associated with varying contexts. Similarly, the Australian curriculum outlines current literacy as reading, viewing, speaking, writing and creating texts that are oral, print, visual and digital, developing knowledge, skills and dispositions, and modifying language for different purposes in a range of contexts. With continual advancements driven by technology, new modes of communication have been more prominent in our daily lives such as written and spoken language, sound, movement, gesture and image. Texts that combine two or more of these modes are called multimodal texts, also known as multimedia. Our young learners engage with representations of multimedia daily, which is why it is critical to take a multiliteracies approach to teaching contemporary literacy. To be multiliterate, students need to develop awareness and competence in using a range of representational text forms to make meaning. A multiliteracies approach focuses on using the codes and conventions relevant to five different systems of literacy. The linguistic system, which encompasses the exploration of oral and written language. The visual system, which includes looking at the way elements are depicted in still or moving images that reflect the perspective of the artist. The audio system, and how sound is produced, how we hear and interpret it, like how sound effects may be added to create subtle meaning. The gestural system, and how actions have observable features that portray intended meaning, for example facial expressions and body language and the spatial system, which includes how positioning, layout and organisation of objects in the space can infer meaning. For today's young students, it is key that literacy is meaningful to their lives. The Australian Literacy Educators Association Declaration highlights the importance of literacy as a social endeavour and suggests that a literate person must have a wide range of abilities and competencies to make meaning in the face of ever-changing social contexts. As literacy is linked with particular cultures and experiences of individuals, literacy education needs to value students' worldview, cultural heritage, home languages and lived experiences. One of our aims when teaching literacy is to help students build their own literacy identity or their backpack. A student's literacy identity is developed from all the literacy knowledge and experiences they have accumulated in their lives, both inside and outside the classroom. The literacy identity becomes a resource upon which they can draw on when trying to make sense of or compose a text. The increase of online social platforms really echoes the notion that engaging with literacy is more of a social endeavour than ever before. The rich communication and collaboration that these platforms elicit forms what we call participatory culture. People have opportunities to engage in varying participatory cultures through YouTube, Instagram, Twitter, Pinterest, Facebook and many more apps. Participatory culture shifts the focus of literacy from one of individual expression to community involvement. So what does literacy look like in our classroom? A diverse range of texts will be selected and viewed in our literacy program, including multimodal texts. To better understand how multimodal texts are designed to achieve a particular purpose, students will use the full resource model to frame their engagement with text. 
In this framework, students get the chance to actively take on four literacy roles of code breaker, text participant, text user, and text analyst. For example, when viewing our weekly BTN segment, students are encouraged to ask the following questions. As a code breaker, students will consider what is the relationship between spoken sounds and written symbols, what elements are interesting, difficult or tricky, what are the words used in the context, do I know words that have similar meaning? The role of the text participant will consider what does this mean to me and how does it relate to my prior knowledge? What are the main ideas of the video? What connections can I make to my life and the wider world? How did I feel watching the segment? As a text user, students will consider what do I do with this text? What is the purpose of this text and how is the information organised? Lastly, the role of the text analyst is to view the video critically, ask what biases or perspectives are portrayed, are there other points of view on this topic? How is the text crafted to represent the interests of the creator? After analysing and interpreting multimodal text through this model, students will be given opportunities to apply their understanding and create their own multimodal text using apps on the iPad and computer. To sustain a literate society, it is not just the sole responsibility of educators, but of parents and carers too. By engaging with positive and genuine literacy practices in the home environment, students have rich opportunities to build their literacy identity. With your support at home, together we can support our 21st century learners on their journey of becoming capable navigators of their world.